Hi, this is David Williams from iExpert Advisor. This is a short video showing our latest EA Builder for MetaTrader 5. VTS, or Visual Trader Studio for MT5, looks and behaves the same as our MetaTrader 4 EA Builder. But of course, it generates MQL5 code that can be used on the new MetaTrader 5 platform. Our goal from the start was to create the same user experience for both VTS MetaTrader 4 and VTS for MetaTrader 5. We were able to meet that goal. Almost all of the features of VTS MT4 are implemented in the same way on VTS MT5. Let me show you how to build a simple EA. From the welcome screen, select new systems and then select custom system. I'm just going to rearrange my elements to make room for my new drawing logic. I'll remove the note and move the end element to the end. I'm going to go ahead and add the ATR function to the drawing. Then I'll add a new logic element and finally a function for opening a trade called FN Open Trade. It's located in the functions tool pane under the VTS menu. Now I'll connect all the elements and choose Save. I'll connect the Start to the ATR element, ATR to the Logic, the Logic True to our Trade Open function, and the Logic False to the End element. I'm going to configure the Logic element. I would like it to return True when the bid price is greater than our ATR value. When it does, it will follow the True path of the Logic and open the trade. So I'll go ahead and set the left operand, our operator, and the right operand for this logic element. Now I'm going to press the build button to generate the MQL5 code and then convert the code into an expert advisor. If the MetaTrader tool folder is not defined, then VTS will attempt to locate it on your hard drive by searching for the installed MetaTrader folder. Here we see VTS is searching the file system to find my MT5 installation. Once it's found, VTS will use the MT5 platform to build our expert advisor. It's done. We've just created our first MT5 expert advisor. Also, the platform tool folder can be defined at any time by going to tools slash options. Thanks for watching my video. If you have any questions, please stop by our website at iexpertadvisor.com.